Bruce Greenwood, the actor, has made a significant impact in the film and television industry. Born on August 12, 1956, in Naranda, Quebec, Canada, Greenwood's career spans over four decades. He is best known for his versatile roles in various genres, from drama to science fiction. Greenwood's portrayal of the American president in the film 13 Days gained critical acclaim, showcasing his ability to take on complex and challenging characters. In the world of television, Greenwood has made his mark as a talented actor in shows such as St. Elsewhere and The Resident. His portrayal of Admiral Perry in the series Star Trek has earned him a loyal fanbase and recognition in the science fiction community. Greenwood's work has not gone unnoticed, earning him a Genie Award for Best Performance by an actor in a leading role in the film The Sweet Hereafter. He has also been nominated for several other awards, including a Primetime Emmy Award for his role in 13 Days. Despite his success, Greenwood remains humble and committed to his craft. He continues to take on new and exciting roles, showcasing his talent and versatility as an actor. Through his work, Greenwood has left an indelible mark on the film and television industry, inspiring aspiring actors and entertaining audiences worldwide. Bruce Greenwood is a renowned actor, known for his work in film and television, among his many legendary roles. One that stands out is his portrayal of Captain Christopher Pike in the Star Trek reboot series. This role helped define his career and solidified his status as a classic star. Another memorable performance of his is in the film 13 Days, where he played President John F. Kennedy's advisor, Kenny O'Donnell. This role showcased his versatility and ability to take on complex characters. Now, we'd love to hear from you. Which work of Bruce Greenwood do you hold closest to your heart? Do you have a favorite memory or personal experience related to this classic star? Share your stories and memories in the comments below. As we continue, get ready to learn some fun, shocking, and sad facts about Bruce Greenwood. So, keep watching! Born on August 12, 1956, in Royan, Naranda, Canada, Bruce Greenwood was exposed to acting at a young age through his father, Hugh John Greenwood, who worked in radio broadcasting. The actor's family moved around quite a bit during his childhood due to his father's job, which allowed him to experience various cultures and ways of life, factors that would later influence his career. Greenwood's mother, Mary Sylvia Lillian, encouraged her son's creative pursuits by enrolling him in music lessons. This classical training would eventually lead to the actor becoming a skilled pianist, providing another layer to his artistic abilities. As a teenager, Greenwood attended high school in Vancouver, where he discovered his passion for theater. He participated in numerous school productions, further solidifying his desire to become an actor. After graduation, he studied philosophy at the University of British Columbia before transferring to American Academy of Dramatic Arts in Los Angeles. During his time at the Academy, Greenwood met several influential figures who helped shape his approach to acting. Among them were renowned teachers like Michael Arabian, who taught him the importance of emotional honesty in performance, and Salome Jens, who emphasized the significance of physicality and presence on stage. These mentors instilled in Greenwood a deep respect for both the craft and its practitioners. After completing his studies, Greenwood returned to Canada and began working in regional theater companies across the country. His experiences on stage laid the groundwork for his subsequent move into film and television, allowing him to hone his skills while learning from seasoned professionals in the industry. Over time, these early influences shaped Greenwood into the accomplished actor we know today. Bruce Greenwood, a Canadian actor, made his mark on the film industry through memorable roles and consistent contributions to both television and movies. Debuting in the late 1970s, he quickly became known for his versatility, excelling in various genres from horror to drama. His breakthrough role came in 1998, when he starred in The Sweet Hereafter, earning him critical acclaim and solidifying his position in Hollywood. This marked the start of many significant parts, including his portrayal of JFK in 13 Days, and Captain Pike in the recent Star Trek films. These performances have left indelible impressions on viewers and significantly contributed to these productions' success. On TV, Greenwood has been equally prolific. He earned Emmy nominations for his work in St. Elsewhere, Now and Again, and Mad Men. Moreover, he played key roles in series like John from Cincinnati and The River, bringing depth and authenticity to each character. His ability to adapt seamlessly across mediums further highlights his talent and influence within the entertainment business. Greenwood continues to take on challenging projects, unafraid to push boundaries and explore new territory. 
With over four decades under his belt, his body of work serves as a testament to dedication and passion towards acting. As we look forward to what comes next, it is clear that Bruce Greenwood will remain an influential figure whose impact resonates throughout the film industry. As a young boy, Bruce Greenwood was captivated by the magic of cinema. One day, while watching a classic film, he found himself completely immersed in the story, feeling the emotions of the characters as if they were his own. It was in this moment that he discovered his passion for acting. Driven by this newfound passion, Greenwood began performing in school plays and community theater productions. He honed his craft over the years, studying drama in college and eventually moving to New York to pursue a career on stage. But it was his role in the critically acclaimed film The Straight Story that truly solidified Greenwood's place as a talented and versatile actor. His nuanced portrayal of a troubled son seeking reconciliation with his estranged father resonated with audiences and critics alike. From there, Greenwood went on to star in numerous films and TV shows, always bringing his unique blend of intensity and vulnerability to each role. Whether he's playing a hero or a villain, a father or a lover, Greenwood's performances are always deeply human and deeply moving. And so, the spark that was ignited in a young boy watching a movie has blossomed into a lifelong passion and a successful career. Bruce Greenwood's contributions to the world of film and television are a testament to the power of creativity and the enduring allure of the arts. Bruce Greenwood, the accomplished actor, was in grade school in Bethesda, Maryland during the Cuban Missile Crisis. He recalls the preparations for possible war vividly, an experience that may have influenced his later career in acting. Throughout his career, Greenwood has received several award nominations, including two Gemini nominations. The first was for Best Performance by an Actor in a Supporting Role for his performance in The Little Kidnappers, and the second was for Best Performance by an Actor in a Guest Role for his performance in Avonlea, a role for which he won the award. Greenwood comes from a family of educators and scientists. His parents are Mary Sylvia Lettingham, a nurse, and Hugh John Greenwood, a geophysicist, geologist, and professor who taught at Princeton University. The actor's paternal great-grandfather was Ralph Allen Sampson, a prominent court-born astronomer who was the Astronomer Royal for Scotland. Despite his family's background in science and education, Greenwood found his calling in the world of acting, captivating audiences with his powerful performances in various films and shows. His contributions to the industry have left a lasting impact, and his legacy continues to resonate with fans and industry professionals alike. Born in 1956, Bruce Greenwood, a Canadian actor, faced numerous challenges early in his career. Financial struggles were common, as he often had to take on odd jobs to make ends meet. Despite these hardships, his resilience and determination never wavered. In the competitive film industry, skepticism towards newcomers is not uncommon. Greenwood, however, refused to let this discourage him. Instead, he used it as motivation to hone his craft and prove his worth. He dedicated countless hours to perfecting his acting skills, attending workshops, and taking classes to expand his knowledge. To overcome industry skepticism, Greenwood sought out creative solutions. He took on roles in independent films and theater productions, showcasing his talent in a variety of settings. This approach allowed him to build a strong reputation and gain recognition from industry professionals. Despite facing numerous obstacles, Greenwood's passion for acting never wavered. He continued to pursue his dream, and his resilience and determination eventually paid off. Today, he is a respected and successful actor, known for his work in both film and television. Through hard work and perseverance, Greenwood was able to overcome the financial struggles and industry skepticism that threatened to derail his career. His story serves as a powerful reminder of the importance of resilience and determination in the face of adversity. After working at a chemical factory to supplement his theatrical career, Bruce Greenwood unexpectedly landed his first movie role in Bear Island. The actor's big break came with the pilot of the HBO series The Hitchhiker, which led to him acquiring his first agent and securing the lead in Legman within a week. Although he auditioned for the lead in Falconer, he was considered too youthful looking for the part. During this time, Greenwood had a year-long contract with Warner Brothers to work on television pilots. The actor's early career was a whirlwind of opportunities that set the stage for his future success. In the early 1980s, Bruce Greenwood's career took a significant turn with his appearance in the critically acclaimed television series St. Elsewhere. His portrayal of Dr. Seth Griffin garnered praise and recognition, setting the stage for his future endeavors. 
A pivotal moment in the actor's film career came with his role in the 1998 drama The Sweet Year After. Directed by Adam Egoyan, this classic film earned Greenwood a Genie Award for Best Actor, highlighting his ability to tackle complex and emotional roles. In 2001, Greenwood took on the role of Captain Christopher Pike in Star Trek, directed by J.J. Abrams. This groundbreaking project not only introduced him to a broader audience, but also allowed him to leave his mark on the iconic science fiction franchise. Colleague Chris Pine, who played Captain Kirk, praised Greenwood's incredible warmth and humanity in the film. In 2012, the actor delivered a chilling performance as President John F. Kennedy in National Treasure Book of Secrets. His uncanny resemblance and nuanced portrayal of the beloved president earned him widespread acclaim, further solidifying his status as a talented and versatile performer. More recently, Greenwood's role as Dr. Randolph Bell in the medical drama The Resident has garnered praise for his portrayal of a complex and morally ambiguous character. Co-star Matt Chuckery, who plays Dr. Conrad Hawkins, described Greenwood as an absolute master of his craft. Throughout his career, Bruce Greenwood has consistently delivered compelling and memorable performances, earning him the respect and admiration of both his peers and critics alike. His ability to bring depth and humanity to his roles has left an indelible mark on the world of film and television. In 1982, actor Bruce Greenwood auditioned for a significant role in the horror sequel Psycho 2. That same year, he was offered a breakthrough role in the television series St. Elsewhere, which he initially declined due to simultaneous filming commitments for another chance. However, he found a way to juggle both roles for several weeks. The actor later took on the challenge of playing Democratic U.S. President John F. Kennedy in the political thriller 13 Days. Interestingly, both Greenwood and fellow actor William Devane, who also portrayed JFK in The Missiles of October, appeared together in the popular soap opera Knott's Landing. Their shared experience in depicting a historical figure adds depth to their respective acting resumes. Bruce Greenwood's artistic vision is deeply rooted in his personal experiences and worldview. The actor is known for his ability to fully embody a character, making them come alive on screen. He often draws upon his own life to inform his performances, giving them a sense of authenticity that resonates with audiences. In his work, Greenwood strives to explore the complexities of the human experience, often choosing roles that challenge him to delve deep into the psyche of his characters. He has a particular talent for portraying characters with a quiet intensity, using subtle body language and facial expressions to convey their inner thoughts and emotions. One of the things that makes Greenwood's approach to acting unique is his willingness to take on a wide range of roles from leading men in big-budget studio films to supporting characters in independent dramas. He is equally at home in front of a camera or on stage, and has even lent his voice to animated projects. Despite his success, Greenwood remains humble and grounded, always eager to learn and grow as an artist. He is known for his collaborative spirit and his ability to work well with others, making him a favorite among directors and co-stars alike. Throughout his career, Greenwood has left an indelible mark on the world of film and television with his performances in classic films and shows such as The Sweet Hereafter, 13 Days, and Star Trek earning him widespread acclaim. His enduring legacy is a testament to his talent, hard work, and dedication to his craft. Bruce Greenwood has had the privilege of being in two films nominated for the Best Picture Oscar Capote in 25 and The Post in 2017. His acting career has spanned several decades, and he has built a strong reputation in the industry. Interestingly, Greenwood's relationship with his wife is as enduring as his career. They went on their first date when they were both 15, around 1971. The couple has been married since 1985, and Greenwood has known his wife for over 45 years. Another fun fact about Greenwood is that he still owns the tuxedo he wore in the 1994 film Harlequin Treacherous Beauties. It's not uncommon for actors to keep mementos from their projects, but it's not often that they hold on to formal wear. In conclusion, Bruce Greenwood's career and personal life are both noteworthy. From his Oscar-nominated films to his long-lasting relationship with his wife, Greenwood has made his mark in the world of acting. And who knows, maybe he still breaks out that tuxedo from time to time. Bruce Greenwood, a seasoned actor, has made significant contributions to the film and television industry. With a career spanning over four decades, he has become a familiar face in many classic films and shows. Greenwood's ability to portray complex characters with depth and nuance has set him apart from his peers, 
According to industry expert Tom O'Brien, Bruce Greenwood has a unique talent for making even the most ordinary characters extraordinary. His performances are always thoughtful and layered, leaving a lasting impression on audiences. His portrayal of Captain Christopher Pike in the Star Trek reboot films is a prime example of his ability to bring depth and humanity to a classic character. Greenwood's performance resonated with both fans of the original series and new audiences, earning him critical acclaim and a loyal fan base. In addition to his work in film, Greenwood has also made a significant impact on television. His role as President John F. Kennedy in the television movie, 13 Days earned him an Emmy nomination and solidified his status as a talented and versatile actor. Greenwood's influence extends beyond his own performances, as he has inspired a new generation of actors. Young actor Jake Johnson cites Greenwood as an inspiration, stating, Bruce Greenwood's ability to disappear into a role is truly inspiring. He has a quiet intensity that is captivating, and I aspire to bring that same level of depth and nuance to my own performances. In conclusion, Bruce Greenwood's impact and influence on the film and television industry is undeniable. His ability to bring depth and humanity to complex characters has left a lasting impression on audiences and inspired a new generation of actors. After auditioning for major roles in both Chicago Hope and Almost Perfect, it was his work on Nowhere Man that led the actor to make a significant lifestyle change. He quit smoking. Beyond his career, Bruce Greenwood has a passion for the great outdoors. He enjoys skiing, skydiving, sailing, and hiking, making the most of nature's offerings. Bruce Greenwood, known for his memorable roles in films and TV shows, leads a life that extends beyond the silver screen. The actor values spending quality time with his family and is passionate about music. Greenwood is also an accomplished pianist and often incorporates his love for music into his work. In addition to his personal interests, Greenwood is deeply committed to various philanthropic efforts. He has been involved with the Children's Hospital Los Angeles, lending his support to better the lives of children in need. Greenwood's dedication to giving back to the community showcases his compassionate nature and highlights his personal values. The actor's work often reflects his interests and passions. For instance, Greenwood's role in the film 13 Days allowed him to explore his love for history, while his performance in the TV series The Resident showcases his musical talents. Greenwood's ability to bring his own experiences and values to his roles adds depth and authenticity to his characters. Greenwood's personal life and values have undoubtedly informed his work, making him a well-rounded and dedicated actor. His commitment to his craft, family, and philanthropic efforts has left a lasting impact on both the entertainment industry and the community. The actor's enduring legacy is a testament to his versatile talents and unwavering dedication. Bruce Greenwood's interest in acting began when he saw Brad DeReef's performance in One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. His acting career took off in Vancouver's theater scene, where he made his debut in a daring performance, swinging across the stage like Tarzan. It wasn't until after his first professional play that he was certain he wanted to act. In the film The Sweet Hereafter, Greenwood lost a front tooth in a tussle and willingly removed it for his role, showcasing his dedication to his craft. As a child, he was known by the nickname Green Dog. Despite his success, Greenwood remains humble and committed to his art. His passion for acting was ignited by a single performance, and he has since become a respected figure in the industry. His career is a testament to his talent and dedication, and he continues to captivate audiences with his powerful performances. Bruce Greenwood has made a significant impact in the film industry through his diverse range of roles and undeniable talent. With a career spanning over four decades, he has left an indelible mark on both the big and small screens. From playing John F. Kennedy in 13 Days to Captain Christopher Pike in the recent Star Trek films, his ability to breathe life into complex characters is truly commendable. When asked about his future contributions, Greenwood mentioned his excitement towards exploring new genres and challenging himself with more demanding roles. He also expressed interest in producing and mentoring up and coming talents something that would surely benefit the next generation of actors. As for those aspiring to follow in his footsteps, the actor advises them to stay true to themselves and never compromise their artistic integrity. In his own words, always choose projects that resonate with you personally, because if it matters to you, it will likely matter to others. Furthermore, he emphasizes the importance of continuous learning and training, stating that there's always room for improvement regardless of one's experience or success. 
Greenwood's longevity in the business can be attributed to these principles. His dedication to his craft, coupled with his respect for the art form, serves as a shining example for anyone looking to make their mark in the entertainment industry. Bruce Greenwood, the accomplished actor known for his work in film and television, was born in Naranda, Quebec, where his father was working on a mining project at the time. For the first six years of his life, Greenwood moved around frequently, living in Princeton, New Jersey, Washington, D.C., Maryland, and back to Princeton. It wasn't until he was 11 that his family settled in Vancouver, where he attended Magee Secondary School in the Carisdale area. Greenwood's academic pursuits took him to the University of British Columbia, where he studied philosophy and economics. He only took his first drama class as an easy credit, but it sparked a passion for acting that would last a lifetime. Despite his love for acting, Greenwood never lived in one place for longer than four years, moving around frequently due to his father's work. Beyond his acting career, Greenwood is also an avid musician, often relaxing by singing and playing his electric guitar. His upbringing in various locations around North America, combined with his love for music and acting, have helped shape him into the talented and versatile performer he is today. Bruce Greenwood, a Canadian actor, has had an impressive journey in the entertainment industry. Born in 1956, he developed a passion for acting early in life. After studying at the University of British Columbia, he began his career on stage before transitioning to film and television. Throughout his career, Greenwood has demonstrated his ability to bring characters to life in a variety of genres. He has starred in numerous films, including The Sweet Hereafter, I, Robot, and Star Trek. In the television world, he has held leading roles in series such as Third Watch and The Resident. Greenwood's work has not only entertained audiences but also inspired them. His performances resonate with viewers, leaving a lasting impact. The actor's ability to innovate and adapt to different roles has kept him relevant in the ever-changing entertainment industry. In the sweet hereafter, Greenwood portrayed a lawyer seeking justice for a small town devastated by a tragic accident. His sensitive and nuanced performance earned him critical acclaim and a Genie Award for Best Actor. In I, Robot, he played a detective navigating a world dominated by artificial intelligence, showcasing his versatility. Greenwood's portrayal of Captain Christopher Pike in the Star Trek reboot introduced him to a new generation of fans. His charismatic and thoughtful performance left an indelible mark on the franchise. In The Resident, he continues to captivate audiences as Dr. Randolph Bell, a complex and flawed character. Beyond his on-screen work, Greenwood has lent his voice to various projects, including animated series and video games. His ability to create compelling characters extends to the audio realm, further solidifying his status as a talented actor. In conclusion, Bruce Greenwood's passion and innovation have left an enduring impact on the entertainment industry. His work continues to resonate with audiences, reminding us of the power of creativity and perseverance. Bruce Greenwood, known for his compelling performances, has left an undeniable mark in the film industry. The actor's career spans over four decades, gracing both the big and small screens with his undeniable talent. Greenwood's work in the critically acclaimed film, The Sweet, hereafter showcases his ability to portray complex and nuanced characters. His portrayal of a small-town lawyer seeking justice following a tragic bus accident resonated with audiences and critics alike, earning him a Genie Award for Best Supporting Actor. In the world of television, Greenwood has also made his presence known. His portrayal of the beloved Captain Christopher Pike in the Star Trek reboot series is a fan favorite. The actor's ability to embody the strength and vulnerability of the character has made him a standout in the iconic franchise. But Greenwood's contributions to the industry go beyond his on-screen work. The actor has lent his voice to various animated projects, including the animated series Batman the Brave and the Bold and the video game Call of Duty Black Ops. Despite his many accomplishments, Greenwood remains humble and dedicated to his craft. His work continues to captivate audiences and leave a lasting impact on the industry. So, let us know in the comments what you think about Bruce Greenwood's work and legacy. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits shaping entertainment.